gladness, sadness, and madness. All of these words can describe one NFL game. Late in the day on September the 26th, Papa Bear George Hallis probably added a few words of his own to describe the afternoon's Coliseum entertainment. As we watch early scoring plays from this game, let's examine these vital keys to NFL success. Every great Broadway play reaches either for the heights of happiness or the depths of despair. These two emotions have great effect on our viewing audience. But football does not have to reach for emotion, it is there. Every season offers the Mount Everest of joy and the Death Valley of despair. Let's illustrate. The Rams have not beaten the Bears since 1959, and the Bears are in front by 19 points as we join the action in the fourth quarter. Munson runs for 11 yards. Five plays later, Munson pushes straight ahead. Touchdown. The score now is Bears 28, Rams 16. The clock shows only 12 minutes to play. A weak putt gives the Rams the ball on the Chicago 49. Munson hits Jack Snow for 14 yards. Terry Baker is the next target for Munson. It's good for 16 yards. The ball is now on the five. Tommy McDonald finds a bit of daylight, an added ray of hope for the Rams as he makes the TD catch and closes the score to Bears 28, Rams 23. Now the clock shows only five minutes to play. The Rams need a touchdown. A field goal is not enough. It's McDonald's turn again as the drive nears midfield. The play nets 12 yards. Patient, despite the most impatient clock, Munson took seven more plays to move to the Chicago 10. Only 34 seconds remain as he takes the snap. Locates Baker and fires. Terry makes a leaping catch, and the comeback is complete. Who could ask for more than a 21-point fourth quarter rally? As we said, it's the Mount Everest of joy. Final score, Rams 30, Bears 28.